Ucalligrapher is an educational game based in VR to teach you how to learn the art of calligraphy. I'll be going over what it offers and hopefully help you decide if this is one for you. First off, there is no story. This is purely an educational game to teach the player calligraphy, which is done through free modes, tutorial, challenge and free play. As for the gameplay, there really isn't much to it. I'll go through the modes and what they offer. First up is tutorial, which isn't really a mode, but it does go through all the various objects on the table and lets you try out different brushes, inks, and a lot more. The basics are pretty simple to get to grips with and won't take you too long. Secondly, I played challenge mode. This isn't really a challenge, it's more just filling in a template and then it gets rated. After doing this 10 times, I was bored. But there are 30 in total, which won't take you too long unless you're aiming for the highest rating. Lastly is free mode, which you can do calligraphy in it if you want, but with the various brushes and colors, I just started drawing. Overall, the gameplay is fine, but it did get a bit boring. Graphics wise they are nothing special, they fit the purpose and look ok. Performance wise it ran very smoothly and had no issues with frame drops or crashes. With the settings there isn't any options to change them, however due to being able to adjust the height of the table you can play the game seated. Now for what I didn't like, personally for me I found the way you hold the brush not to be accurate. For example, when gripping the sense control, the bristle on the brush would show at the base of the controller, therefore you can imagine the grip of the controller being the handle of the brush. This isn't how you would hold it, and even the hand in the game doesn't hold it like that. I think having the section elevated on an easel would have been a better option. I did however try playing it while holding the sense controller more like a brush, which did feel a bit uncomfortable but did make the game feel more authentic. Either way, it does take away from the experience slightly. I also tested to see if the brush moves on its own, which it does, so this further adds a lack of accuracy when doing the templates. There are achievements in the game which reflect to the trophies for you to get, but there isn't any platinum on this one. Overall, U Calligrapher is a peaceful game which can be enjoyed in small doses. The challenge mode can offer some playtime, but it's certainly not something I would like to keep repeating. So, should you get this game? Well, if you want something peaceful, then you may enjoy it. However, if you're not really into a peaceful game or something that doesn't offer a lot, then I'd say avoid this one. Personally for me, I can't really recommend this one. Even for the price, it's quite lacking. Although I didn't necessarily dislike my time in the game, I did find it quite boring after a short period. This concludes my review of U Calligrapher. If you've enjoyed this video, then make sure to stick around as I intend on covering all PSVR 2 games, therefore you'll see the new releases as well as the old. Thanks for watching.